Hello, Colors. Welcome back to Viva Barca. And welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on the latest transfer stories, starting with Aurea Romeo, as it has been reported that the former La Masia midfielder is waiting for Barcelona offer so strongly as advancements are moving positively. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking about Inigo Martinez, as it has been reported that the Barca new signing is currently at the club's training facilities ahead of official announcement. We are also going to be discussing on that. So guys, as we get right into the full stories, please do ensure to subscribe if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. A written update regarding Aria Romeo's future has indicated that the 31-year-old is currently waiting for Barca to make a move for him. Adding to this news, Mundo Deportivo also claims that Barca has informed the midfielder that there should be advancements on Monday or Tuesday. The outlet claims that Xavi is in a hurry to finalize that transfer. This is mostly because he has made peace with the fact that the 31 year old is the best low cost option available for them in the market. Adding to it, he is also a former La Masia player, meaning that he somehow understands the Barca philosophy and the DNA that is the style of play. On the other hand, there are some people at the club who believe that the team should wait for some exits. Javi's idea, however, remains the fact that the team should sign a defensive midfielder to cover the hole left by Sergio Busquets' departure before pre-season camp begins on July 10. All this uncertainty has forced Romeo to wait for Barcelona. He is willing to see what happens between Girona and Barcelona. He is totally aware of Barcelona's interest, but he wishes to stay in the background. As far as Girona are concerned, they are not one to speak on the transfer as they are staring or starting to feel extremely upset with Barca over the Blaugrana contacting Romeo directly without approaching the club. Earlier, they were flexible to negotiate a fee, but right now, Girona are in no mood to do that. The message is direct. If you want to sign our player Romeo, then you must pay the termination clause, which is worth 10 million euros. Barcelona understands that Romeo is the most affordable option available now in the market. They try to inquire for the likes of Martin Zubimendi and Joshua Kimmich in the past, but the operation for the two are exceeding the budget. Lastly, they are also trying to go for Marcelo Brozovic, but the Croatian is moving to Saudi Arabia instead. Of course, the search for DM has not been an easy task at all. And honestly, many people never saw this coming. Like Barca would take such a long time to, to get to know who their real DM or their, their, their DM to replace Busquets would be. And before even talking about Aurel Romeo as the main target now, Barca have lost four different targets from Martin Zubimendi, Joshua Kimmich, Sofian Amrabat, and Marcelo Brozovic were all strongly linked, but at the end, what happened? Everything collapsed, all because of financial problems, financial incapabilities from the club. And of course, you can't blame the club for that because their hands are tied. And now talking about Aurea Romeo of Girona, who, who according to new report, is very excited about the, the prospect of playing for Barca. Again, we quite remember he is from Barca's La Masia Academy in the past. And of course, the, the player is exciting about the prospect of joining. And when we look critically about the price tag, which is 10 million euros, what Girona are exclusive, I think it's still affordable. It's very much affordable by Barca, despite the economic situation. And that is why Barca want to really rely on this um, guy to be their next defensive midfielder because his price is quite cheap. And they know that if they lose out on him, then sorry. I don't know who else Barca want to look after because Barca have been missing out on some important players. And of course, let's see what happens. Ori Romeo is already 31 years of age, which means that Barca are not buying him to keep him for such a long time like the Gavis, the Pedris, you know, but at least his vast experience according to what we have been getting. 
is what manager Javi likes a lot and also the fact that he is from La Masia he will greatly understand the philosophy and it wouldn't be that difficult for Ora Romeo to integrate into Javi's setup you know so let's see what happens in the DM role they were even saying that there is no general consensus being agreed upon within the Barca offices about Aurea Romeo as Javi is the one who is really pushing for the player. But I think there are some members of the board of directors who are questioning why should Barca be going strongly for this 31 year old when there are players like Nico Gonzalez in the ranks that Javi should at least go for them since he has failed in his top choices in, um, in Nico Mart I'm sorry, in Martin Zubemendi and Joshua Kimmich, Javi could have even gone for players like, um, you know, players like um, Nico Gonzalez, who is a DM too, and from La Masia. Why could Javi not put some trust? But as it stands right now, Javi have decided and the Barca board are following suit. You know, they want to ensure that at least they bring in Aurel Romero, who has long been linked with the club. And of course, Girona are asking just 10 million euros. Then moving on to the final story of discussion, that Barcelona have an agreement with Inigo Martinez over a free transfer this summer is no secret. The Catalan Giants have had uh, an agreement in place with a Spanish defender for quite some time now, while his medicals were also successfully completed last month. However, an official announcement is yet to be made by the club, given that his contract with Athletic Club ran until June, 20, um, June 30. The delay was understandable, and now that his deal with the Basque outfit has expired, the Blaugrana are preparing for an official announcement imminently. Indeed, as reported by Gigantes FC, Martinez was in Barcelona today morning. More specifically, the 32-year-old was the club's Suita Desportiva Juan Gampa training complex where he participated in a photo session, posing for pictures and videos for the official announcement of his transfer. Martinez once announced will be Barcelona's second senior signing of the summer after the arrival of Ilkay Gundogan, who also signed on free transfer from Manchester City. The Spaniards arrival provide Barca with a left-footed center half option, something that Xavi had been seeking to add to his roster, having had to use Marcos Alonso as a makeshift center half at times last season. Martinez's imminent arrival, though, could spell an end to Eric Garcia's time at the club, with reports suggesting that La Masia Gareth could be on his way out to Real Betis this summer. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.